The studio to the kitchen on this Monday morning. How lucky are we? GoProvidence.com have brought us our very special guest, and I'm not just saying that like I do most days. <laughs> Stephen Gilman is here from Poppy's Waffles Food Truck. Good morning, sir. Good morning. How are you doing? I have, I, oh, I'm great. I haven't been able to sleep all weekend thinking of the, about the waffles, and now that the aroma has you know uh, permeated the area as only it can, I can't wait to sample. But today you're going to be making for us assorted dessert waffles. Is there a, a focus here? Is it is it open? You're going to just dazzle us with everything? What's yeah. Yeah, I'm just happening. gonna make six or seven different waffles, oh. all different kinds, and I might even throw in a savory chicken and waffles. Uh, well, that's enough to feed me. I don't know about the rest of the crew, but <laughs> take us through some of the ingredients here of what you'll be working okay. with. It looks great. You know, we've got crumbled Reese's, we've got uh, fruity pebbles cereal, walnuts, fine coconut, almonds, crumbled Oreo cookie, marshmallows, chicken, bananas. And these are all the toppings from peanut butter to maple syrup to caramel, chocolate, glazed icing, strawberry. I want to take these one by one, one. Stephen, and just toss them back <laughs> and just enjoy them because they are always so tasty. And I can't wait to see what you do, how you assemble all of this. Talk to us about the truck. I mean, where we can find you guys. I know there's something happening later today. Yep, later today from 11 to 2 is a pop-up at the carousel at Roger Williams Park. It's going to be great. Get all the kids out, they're on vacation, you're looking for something to do with them, it's gonna be warm and get them out there. The biggest kid of all, can't wait to, of course, uh, indulge right here on these waffles. And uh, so you can kind of take us through the process this morning if anyone wants to try one of these monstrosities at home. Yeah, basically, you know, you know, get a waffle maker, you don't have to have a commercial one and, you know, make up your waffle and just get your dressings and top it off, whatever. Create your own. That's that simple is what it is. Great to have you here. Stephen Gilman, of course, Poppy's Waffles Food Truck. Thanks for rolling on in this morning. We'll follow his lead all morning. Back to you. Now I think I've yammered it up long enough to make Michaela arrive in the kitchen. Thanks so much, <laughs> sure. Brennan. Yes, you did. Uh, we talked about things to do on a day off, and maybe making a big breakfast is one of those, like some delicious waffles. Poppy's Waffles Food Truck joins us now, thanks to GoProvidence.com. Where do we stand? I mean, well, your waffles are to the next level. Well, we gotta, we got to get keep people interested. Yeah. So we'll get the uh, chicken for the chicken and waffles. Get that ready. We'll get this in the oven. Okay. I love that you have so many different combinations. How many different waffles do you oh, guys have it's coming endless. on it? Right now, I get hollered at because he says I have too many. Eric says you get too many waffles on the <laughs> menu, but you can never have too many. Yeah. People always want something different. Mm -hmm. and even and go match. to the point with build your own. You know, pick all the ingredients and hey. just say what you want on it. There you go. A little of everything. So. I'll take one of everything. Uh, speaking of one of everything, we need yep. one of some things, anyways, on our, what yeah. is it, a s'mores waffle that we're about this, to make? This, we're going to get a s'mores waffle ready. Okay. Get the chocolate syrup on it. Yeah. That looks good. And this is a traditional, like, Oh, yeah, that's waffle. traditionally okay. on the menu at all times. Mm -hmm. Get the marshmallows on it. Right. And all the graham cracker crumbs. Oh, that's a great way to do it. We'll get now, this. I know I love putting them over the fireplace. How are we We're going to put it in up? the oven after okay. get it in the oven, get it melted out. Yeah, because you want those marshmallows just get They'll ooey, get all ooey. poofy and all golden brown on top. How long does it take you to, to come up with the, the right combination? I mean, this is a traditional combination, but, you know, how many marshmallows and how much chocolate it's and it's just, on a it's, waffle? It's just a matter of, you know, you're making them and you look at it and you look at the presentation and look yeah. at how full the waffle is. Mm -hmm. Is there enough on it? Do you need to put more on it? Yeah. What is, you know, what are you doing with it? You want to make sure the people are going to enjoy it and have enough for their money. Yeah, and also enjoy the taste of the waffle right. at the same time. You probably don't want to overpower, you don't want to overpower that overpower either. It. Um, well, that looks delicious. Okay, so we'll pop that in the oven for just a couple of minutes and make that marshmallow ooey gooey and melty. That's not the only waffle that they have or that we're making here in the kitchen this morning. We'll tell you more and where you can see them today. Oh, I love waffles. I hope you do too. It's a new song. Do you love waffles, Brennan? Yes, I do. I love breakfast food. Um, and Stephen does too because we have a whole food truck dedicated That's to it. waffles. It's um, like a heaven on wheels. That's it. It's, it's everybody's like that. dream. Yeah. The nickname, heaven on wheels. Just like yep. riding in the car with me, but that's not why we're here. Um, Let's talk about the preparation. Yeah, we're making okay. a bunch of waffles today and folks can come see you yep. uh, today around at 11 o'clock. 11 to 2 at the carousel at Roger Williams Park. to be a few other food trucks there, mm -hmm. so everybody can come out, have a great time. Yeah. The weather's going to be nice. And enjoy a sweet treat yep. like this. Okay, so bring us up to speed. Um, let's talk about the chicken and waffles. Chicken and waffles. Just made. Yep. You just took that chicken out in the break. Yeah, waffle with maple syrup and uh, powdered sugar mm. on top. 
wow, that looks good. So you're going to get the crunch of that chicken yeah. nice and hot. This and then perfect for someone who's watching their calories like me. <laughs> 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 no. hey, it's okay to indulge. I, I was just going to say, every now and then, you need to indulge, and I will today. That looks awesome. Um, wow. And this is our s'mores waffle that you, if you were watching just the... The segment before, we got all the ingredients on there, and look at how much the marshmallows have puffed up. Unbelievable. That golden brown color. Oh, and now more, Stephen. What are you going to add? Well, you have to put a little bit of a drizzle of chocolate on top of it. To As I like to say, give it the appearance. Get an umbrella because there's a light drizzle going on <laughs> in the kitchen. <laughs> That's it. Now, Looks can we awesome. help you assemble some other ones? Yeah, with this one here, we're going to uh, add. So you can add some coconut to it. Okay. What are we aiming for with this we're one? I doing, know it's a uh, chocolate batter. That one we're doing in Almond Joy. Oh, yeah. Size nice gloves that I did you hand me an extra small. <laughs> I don't know. I just <laughs> grabbed them. <laughs> Circulation is cut. Oh, off. yeah. Whipped cream. Get it going. That's the sound of happiness right yes, there. Yes, it is. <laughs> Very nice. And top it with? Top it with the almonds. The almonds. Oh, my gosh. This looks so good. Uh, I'm not going to skimp on toppings nope, either. Nope, nope, you can't skimp. Where else can we catch you? We know later today, uh, of course, Roger Williams Park Zoo, but where else? Uh, basically, a lot of the PVD food truck events all summer. Mm -hmm. uh, March, we do uh, the opening at uh, Sons of Liberty down in Wakefield. Great spot, yeah. April 17th, kicks off Food Truck Friday. We'll be there every Friday. Fun. We've participated in this in the past and been down there yes. and seen all mm -hmm. you guys working together. And there's nothing like a, a good food truck, especially when it's uh, serving something as good as this. Oh, yeah. All right, next up next is... One, this one's going to be a Reese's. We put the oh peanut my butter. Gosh. By the way, they were cutting off the, the chocolate. So that's the end of those right there. <laughs> and then if you want to sprinkle some of the oh my gosh. Reese's on there, I'll Reese's get this cups. one out of the waffle maker. Yeah. One of the waffles. Oh, it's yelling at us. One of the yep. waffles is flatlined. Hey, I'm done. This All looks right. amazing. Our Reese's waffle. All right. And then with this one here, we'll. Oh, yeah. More whipped cream. Oh More whipped cream. Gracious. Now you mentioned having a lot of waffles on the Do you know how many you have? Is it dozens? Is oh, it it's probably, I'm going to say two or three dozen different waffles. That is so cool. So something for and everyone. Let's see, we need a little more. Reese's to put on top oh, of that. I used it all. That's all right. I didn't know that's I was all right. No, nope, that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> this looks. I'm just looking at the crew over here, mm. watching everything. We are just blown away by what you're doing here, sir. This looks so good. How long have you been uh, in business? This is going on my fourth season. Wow. Awesome. With and the, very with successful. The food truck. Clearly and done very well. It's been it's been exciting. Mm -hmm. I really enjoy it. Well, we, we enjoy it too. Looks like you're on uh, social media as well, yep. so we can find you Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, puppies corn on, on Twitter and pop yeah that's the the kettle corn business I started 10 years ago and then Which when it's also really good when yeah. the time that came that I wanted to uh, retire I needed something to keep myself busy so how is a young man like you <laughs> retired I don't get it Stephen so why <laughs> I'll not just waffles? switch this over here and we'll let Michaela put some okay. fruity pebbles on yes do I need to save any for a garnish you I can yeah you should save a little bit okay. for the top what did you sprinkle this with um, prior to this? It was uh, glazed icing, something that would be on top of yep. a Cinnabon, <laughs> and then uh, a little bit of maple syrup. Mm -hmm. I see you can build your own waffle as well. There's many options on the menu here. Yeah, well, that's the other thing. If something's not there, if there isn't, we grab another whipped cream. Mm -hmm. And I will continue to top with the fruity pebbles. Well, if we didn't make something that you don't enjoy, you can make your own, build your own. Today's a good waffle day. Stephen, great to have you here, sir. I appreciate it. Thank you very much much. Poppy's Waffles is what you need to know and of course you guys can catch them later today of course mm -hmm. 11 a.m. at the Roger Lewis Park, 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 Park Carousel. Let's just toss them back yep. fruity pebbles. Or Can't you get beat it. More, more info on them at roadshow.com.